that's a baby becomes a part of our church. And we want to let the church know even though they are not able to be here, this is our little baby to be blessed. And it is a miracle. It is a miracle to have a child. My wife and I had to wait for 11 years, a constant praying. And then one day, God opened the floor and it's over. So, 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 thank God for the miracle, and thank God for the blessing you too. To the parents, what you're doing today is you're saying to God, I trust you more than I trust myself. And I'm giving my child to you. Because we won't see every spot the child is in. We won't see every place the child is in. We want the child is in care, daycare. We want to make sure God is the one who's protecting him from all earth, harm, and danger. So your act today is not just a symbol. It is a reality of giving your child back to God. And to the God parents, are they here? Yes. To the God parents, please make sure you're part of the child's life. If anything was to happen to the parents, this child should not have to wonder who you are. Be a part of life. Even if the parents decide they don't like each other anymore, make sure you stay with this child. The purpose of God's parents is to act as part of the family. When the parents are losing their minds, y'all have to step in to protect this child. God gives them to us, and we must save them. To the parents, families, your role as an adventure of heaven in the black family to make sure this child is gone. Spoil the child. It is not enough. Just make sure you teach him life now. Give this child everything life can offer so that he won't have to look for things in order to find love and find care. You all have certainly done a great deal by deciding to invest in this child's life. At this time, I'm going to pray that even though he's in my hands now, that God is in his hands to take care of him. Let's pray. Oh God, our Father, I thank you, God, for this baby. And while I hold this baby in my arms, I realize, God, it is not my arms that matter. It is your arms. So, Father, while you have given him to us, we now give him back to you. Strengthen him, God. Strengthen him even now while he's curious to what's going on. And, Father, every person, everything that touches him, Father, transform the thing that it will not become anything that will harm you. We thank you, God, and we trust you, God, more than anything else in life. So, Father, we put him in your hand, and we say, God, we have your way with his life. Whatever you so desire, we give him back to you. And, Father, at the end of the day, your will be done. Your will be done in this child's life. We thank you, and, God, we praise you in the name of Jesus. We thank you for his parents, strengthen them both, continue to build them both, increase their faith and their knowledge of you. We thank you for the grandparents, we thank you for the godparents, we thank you for the cousins, the aunts, the nieces, the uncles, every person, God, we thank you for all of them. This is a new addition to the family. And Father, we thank you for Isaiah Fair, because he's a part of us as well. So Father, we pray that you will continue to hold this child and let this child lead us to see you in a greater glory. We thank you, and God be praised you. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 I am great. I am great. I don't think I'm great. He's not even fair. Our newest baby, Andre Coleman Jr. God bless you, and have a smile on you. In the tradition of my family, I give the son Back to you. Take care.